There's a munchak just ahead of me there. He's got his, he's actually facing me as a male, a buck, he's facing me. The wind is, well, there's hardly any wind. It's not a good position to be in here because he could raise his head any minute. He seems quite happy grazing. I think I'm about 50 yards away. A beautiful stripey, striped type face. Dark colour because it's winter. He's grazing around quite happily. I can't see his mate. The mate's usually around. I'll just see if I can get a little bit closer. Beautiful animal. I'm very surprised he hasn't heard me yet. I'm making a bit of noise. I'm talking to you. Luckily the ground is quite soft. So I'm not making a lot of noise when I'm trying to stalk up. I'm about 40 yards away now. The most important thing is if I am spotted, you've got to keep absolutely still and blend in with the background and hopefully you'll carry on grazing. wind is certainly in my direction. I just felt a gust out then. It's right in my face. So I'm absolutely perfect for this stalk. It's going to stay here for a while. Get a couple of still shots as well. Munt Jack aren't native to the UK, of course. They were brought in from uh, India, around that area, Asia, by the Duke of Bedford. And they escaped from Bedfordshire. Well, we're in Essex, that's not so far away. So there's quite a few Munt Jack in the area. They're very elusive, and they tend to be uh, uh, to stay in the woodland under cover. But this one, uh, who's actually coming towards me, uh, this one is taking advantage of the sunshine in winter. It's January. Sorry, no, it's February, and uh, taking advantage of the warmth to come out and do a bit of feeding on the new. Uh, shoots which are undoubtedly coming through now on the ground. Okay, I'm going to stalk up a little bit further. I 
muntjac breed at any time of the year. There isn't a rut like some of the other deer. But spring is a good time for baby muntjac to pop around because of the warmth. I'm about 35 to Okay, that was a pretty good stalk. Uh, I was following him for, I suppose, a good 10, 10 minutes. Um, I went from 50 yards to about 20 yards. Uh, unfortunately, the closest point there was about 20 yards. And I just moved too much. And at the same time, he looked at me and bang, he was gone off into uh, those, those woods there. Uh, so I'm going to... I'm going to have a quick look to see. Um, I'm going to have a quick look to see if there is anything there. See if I can uh, uh, follow him even more. But uh, the chances are he's uh, he's gone. But uh, yeah, quite pleased with that one. See you later. Bye.